Hey guys, welcome to another edition of the Screen Team, and I'm super excited about this one because I've got Kim Scott with us. Kim, how you doing? I'm doing wonderful. How are you? I'm awesome because you're here, but also because this is an hour-long show, and we're celebrating six years of the Screen Team. Wonderful. It's great, man. We've been doing this for six years, and of course, you're one of our newest members of the team, and you have picked uh, three movies that are kind of close to your heart, correct? Yes, that's correct. We're going to be doing uh, the movie Stand By Me, which a lot of you guys uh, know. Uh, For those who don't know, stick around because we're going to tell you why it's an awesome, awesome flick. We're also going to be doing a movie called Shag, which Kim just loves. She loves the movie Shag. We're going to find out why here in a few minutes. But first, we're going to start off with a movie called Sweet Dreams. And this movie, who is this? Who's this movie about? It's based on the life of Patsy Cline. Patsy Cline. All right. So it's not Coal Miner's Daughter then? It's not? No. Okay. Oh, no. All right, that's so, her best friend, but is it really? Yeah, I did not know that. Yes, man, I gotta keep up with the the country artist. Yes, you do. All right, so uh, Sweet Dreams. It's a movie I haven't seen, but one that you love personally. It's about Patsy Cline, and from the get go, we kind of meet Patsy Cline not from the beginning, but uh, from her, I guess, her beginning relationship with her husband. Correct. Right. Well, she's actually married at the time when we first meet her, but she's singing in a like a bar, mm-hmm. and that's where her future husband comes in and meets her. I was surprised, man. Patsy Cline, she's kind of a rascalian. She she likes yeah. to get out and have she's a good rowdy. time. and very rowdy. Um, played by Jessica Lange. Jessica Lange did a... She did an awesome job portraying her life. Yeah. Very good job, as Ed Harris did. As, I, her. as her husband, right? Yes. You know, Ed Harris, he just, from the very get-go, he was kind of weird because... He wanted to meet Patsy Cline. He wanted to get involved with her. And the first moment, like, he, he meets her in that bar, he's just, like, staring at her. Yeah. He's got that creepy, like, And she totally shuns him. Just What's up? How you him. doing? Yeah. <laughs> so he doesn't give up, man. He keeps, he keeps going. And she's singing at this, this other bar, and he's doing that creepy guy scare. He's like. <laughs> and I, I can't remember. I think she might have messed up or something like that. And she kind of gives it back to him. And then that's kind of when the connection Yep. Kind of grows grows further, and uh, and uh, they kind of hook up and become husband and wife and stuff like that. And then her career kind of starts take it off, and then he ends up not being the best husband. What that a surprise he could be to her! <laughs> but um, you know he's he he loves her deep down, mm-hmm. but he you know on the outside didn't make wise choices to show it. Mm-hmm. But you know, like you said, you know she's very stubborn and bullheaded. And she would just pop right back off to him. One of the know. cool things is is we see this relationship between her and her husband, but they also show the relationship between her and her mom. Yeah. I, thought, I thought that was a kind of a cool relationship too. Yes, very much so. Her mom was very. They were, you know, they were mother and daughter, but they almost kind of had like a sister kind of friend vibe to them. Yeah. You know, they they both knew each other inside and out, and they didn't put up with each other's bs for not at all (laughs) uh for very long um so is this a movie you like because you like the movie or is it because you like patsy klein's music because i like her music i like the story of her life Mm -hmm. and um i just always grown up liking you know the old country Mm -hmm. music that was just me since i was young i my dad always listened to it and i grew up listening to it and she's one of my favorite artists that i love to sing Mm -hmm. and um i don't know just her whole story in general, I loved it. So is this a movie that you put on with the kids, or is this just a, no. a, Kim, a Kim movie by by yourself, popcorn kind of thing? Just me by myself. All right, there you but go. Yeah, because there's, you know, like I said, they like to go out and have a good time mm-hmm. and do their share of drinking and cussing, <laughs> and um, yeah, so probably not one for for the kiddos, but okay. one I personally like. It's called Sweet Dreams. It stars Jessica Lang and also Ed Harris. Coming up after the break, we're going to review the movie Shag. It's next on KWOC.